Is my property in a flood zone? That's the question that concerns both homeowners and shoppers. Does being in a flood zone affect a home's price? Whether you're a seller or a buyer, keep in mind that a home's price is likely to be affected if it is in a floodplain. Sellers know the cost of yearly flood insurance could affect what buyers can afford. So when the home is priced to sell, they will probably take those extra expenses into account. The property could also be seen by buyers as less desirable if the risk of damage from future flooding is high. So a highly motivated seller might list the home lower than the market value. Do you need flood insurance? Did you know that most home insurance policies don't cover damage or other losses caused by flooding? Homes in high risk areas that participate in the NFIP are required to purchase flood insurance. But if you live in a moderate to low risk area within or just outside of a floodplain, should you buy flood insurance? Flood zones are based on an estimation of the number of storms that will cause flooding in a year, but there's no guarantee that your area will flood. Still, you will want to be covered in the event something does happen. If you're wavering between buying and not buying flood insurance, ask yourself this question. Do you think the possibility of flooding and the damage associated with it is worth the insurance premium? In some cases, having flood insurance is less expensive than the losses from a flood. Here are some tips on how to minimize your flood losses. One, elevate your furnace, water heater, and electric panels to protect them from possible floodwaters. Two, keep storm drains and gutters free of debris and install check valves or one-way valves to keep your flood water from backing into your drains. Number three, seal your basement walls with waterproofing materials. Number four, store your valuables and legal documents on your upper floors. All right, so as you can see, flood zones are no joke. So make sure you have a trusted real estate agent to help you find the right house and discuss potential flood risk with. I make new videos every week, so be sure to subscribe to my channel. If you like this video, be sure to give it a thumbs up. If you have any suggestions, drop it in the comments and I will add it to my next video. Thanks for watching. Bye for now.